Having followed Dr. Greger for quite some time now, it's rare that I hear him say that he's discovered something brand new that he had never heard about before when it comes to plant-based diets. So you're not going to want to miss today's video. Dr. Greger is going to talk about an amazing family of molecules that help our cells control the kinds and amounts of proteins they make and that help control gene expression and may explain why a plant-based diet is so powerful. So let's take a listen and then we'll come back and have a look at a fascinating study. How not to age. So, for example, I have a whole chapter on microRNAs. When I graduated from medical school, I had not even been characterized yet. So no wonder I didn't know anything about it. I mean, we didn't even know the whole system in biology. And so it was basically like learning along with the rest of the scientific world. I, I totally nerded out. And it, it just represents an entire new system of why, basically, why plants are so good for us and why animal foods are bad for us. You know, it's just like you learn about the microbiome and you're like, oh, no wonder. It's all about the fiber. It's all about no wonder whole plant foods are so good for you. You learn about inflammation. Oh, no wonder. An anti-inflammatory diet. Now it makes sense. And same thing with these microRNAs or xenohormosis or all these other new exotic entire fields of medicine. It's like, oh, that's why milk is so bad for us. Oh, now it makes total sense now. You know, that kind of thing. It's been a, quite, a, quite an interesting journey for me. Scientific data has shown that long-term vegetarian diets play a role in longevity, but we haven't really known the underlying mechanisms for these observations. So this is where micro RNAs come in. Researchers of this study were able to identify several differentially expressed microRNAs between vegetarians and non-vegetarians, which were involved in immune response, cytokine signaling, cell growth and proliferation, as well as age-related diseases such as neurodegenerative and cardiovascular diseases. They found that a vegetarian diet modulates aging-associated circulating microRNAs, and in particular, several microRNAs were associated with neurodegenerative diseases and connective tissue diseases, which suggests that there's a potential protective role of vegetarian diets against these age-related disorders. And the scientists commented that these significant microRNAs could serve as potential biomarkers for studying vegetarian diet modulated longevity in future dietary intervention studies. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment below and subscribe for more upcoming videos.